What's going on you guys? Welcome back to another My name is Jeff. Reacts. Hope you guys are having a fantastic day. It's now Wednesday. It is the middle of the week. We're making it through day by day. Little by little. We're almost there guys. Hang in there. We're almost to another weekend. You guys, I'm going to go out just on a limb here. I know Thanksgiving just ended, but Christmas is right around the corner now. You know, I know we're all going to, you know, go back to our jobs for a few weeks and go back to real life things. But Christmas is literally right around the corner. We're going right back to another holiday. Things are still busy. Just try All I'm going to say is just try to remember that, you know, it is the holiday season and we all like to spend time with our family and friends or whatever you like to do. I don't know why I'm getting like this right now, but I'm just trying to say enjoy yourself. It's life's too short. I'm personally still excited. Like I like the holidays. I'm not a huge fan of winter in itself mostly because i used to live in wisconsin and there's a lot of snow and i know a lot of people think snow is super beautiful especially for christmas i personally had enough of it but that's whatever i'm still excited about the holidays i still love it and now my second favorite holiday is coming up christmas i love christmas and the fourth of july i guess i shouldn't say my second favorite i love i love them both equally but i have to i'm gonna stop rambling now i love you guys hope you're all having a great day i'm just saying i'm happy i'm enjoying myself right now I hope you guys are having a great day and a great week. We're almost to the weekend again. Hang in there, guys. And if you are dealing with anything, anything at all, just remember that you are not alone. You are never alone. You are a warrior. You are a soldier. Stay strong. I believe in you. And if you need it, the comments are there for you to vent or you can DM me personally on my socials. But you do got this. You're amazing. You're awesome. You're unique in every way. I know it's easier said than done, but you are awesome. You are strong. You do got this. You want a bro fist? High five. You got this, guys. I'm right there with you. Now, if I may transition just a little bit, guys. Today, once again, there is no specific request for it. I mean, I know a lot of you loved the Black Symphony show from Within Temptation. You especially loved the videos that I made for it. I realize I've been making a lot of executive, executive decisions lately and just jumping on certain songs. And I am sorry for that. I do have some requests. I've seen them build up again. But I'm just kind of trying to keep the stockpile rolling and kind of just keep making whatever content I can. I hope you guys don't mind that. This will probably be the last time that I do this specifically for a while. But you guys still seem to be enjoying the content. So I will get back to requests, like official requests, but I know you guys love the Within, Within Temptation show. I personally, you know, I want to get back to Within Temptation. So I'm going to shut up and just get right into this. This intro every time, man. Okay, I'm a little wrong. That much. That is this intro.
sorry. I just, I gotta say something. Dude, I'm just so overtaken by this. I wanna say overtook. Dude, Sharon just came out like a, it just hit me like a ton of bricks just to hear that voice. Like, I just felt chills in a whole other way. And I don't mean that to sound weird. That intro, I, I, I can't even explain that. I like how the crowd knew what the song was gonna be. I didn't, but I still like love them interacting with it. Like I just, and I loved how tense it just felt and in a good way. Like I didn't know what was happening, but I liked it. Dude, this, once again, we are back to Sharon Denadel within Temptation and this whole orchestra thing. Dude, the freaking, oh, the chorus guys, whatever. Sorry, my terms, brain not working lately. This is just so epic and beautiful at the same time. I know it's not even over and I'm just in love with it. I am in such awe. And Sharon's voice as always, it's operatic and it's amazing. Let's get into it again. I don't need to stay paused for long. Dude, oh, okay, my battery's flashing again. Hopefully I can get enough out here, but man, that was just magical on so many levels, just powerhouse. Once again, Sharon, the band, the choir, orchestra, mm -mm. dude, I literally got chills in the end. I mean, at the beginning, I was loving it. I thought this was tense, this is awesome. Okay, I did love it. But at the end, I got chills. Like, I literally got chill, like goosebumps. Like, that is literally the stuff that I find difficult to describe because it's so amazing. It's so impactful. And I just never know what to really say. Like, I feel like I'm speechless, but I still want to go out on a limb and say something. Like, I got to give credit where it's due. I have to acknowledge them. No, but I'm just in awe. I am in absolute awe. I could ramble about this forever. Let's go uh, look up the lyrics and stuff. I've been dreaming for so long to find a meaning, to understand the secret of life. Why am I here to try again? Will I always, will you always see the truth when it stares you in the face? Will I ever, will I free myself by breaking these chains? I'd give my heart, give my soul, I'd turn it back. It's my fault. Your destiny is forlorn. Have to live until it's undone. I'd give my heart, give my soul, I'd turn it back. And then at least I'll be on my way. I've been living for so long, many seasons passed me by. I've been, I've seen kingdoms through ages, rise and fall, I've seen it all. I've seen the horror, I've seen the wonders happening just in front of my eyes. Will I ever, will I never free myself by taking it, by making it right? I give my heart, give my soul to turn it back, it's my fault, my destiny is for long. Jillian, our dream ended long ago. All our stories and all our glory I held so dear. We won't be together forever and ever, no more tears. I'll always be here till the end. I'd give my heart, I'd give my soul. So, I don't know. I honestly, I don't know. I wanna say in my usual that it's about a relationship, but it feels like this is about someone that's just 
gone. Like either they passed away and you long for them or they're still around, but obviously you were in love, but they're gone now. Like you'd give anything to have them back or something. I'm just gonna look at the meaning. Let's just do that. This is the comments for this meaning site. I'm already seeing a lot of arguments. I'll just read off one of them and someone, yeah, I found it. I was right. The song is about Zilverdok, which apparently means Silver Dagger, Van Catherine Kerr. As someone above was here was pretty close because he said it was about reincarnation. The book is about a guy who's turned immortal as a punishment until he made his wrongdoing right again. So he is forced to live for ages. He lives a lot of centuries and he sees reincarnations, a magic ability of his, of people he knew. Jillian is a girl he loved and he meets her in several reincarnations over like a thousand years. So in other words, what you're saying, what you're implying is it's about a guy who is basically just a big old jerk and in order for him to like learn the error of his ways, they turned him immortal so that he could be punished, especially to fall in love with the same girl over and over again, but in different lives. I mean, it's it's interesting. I'm not gonna sit here and say I hate it. It's very interesting in a good way, I'd say. You're a bad person, so they're making you immortal to punish you, and the girl you fell in love with, you're just gonna keep, it's like technically he's still getting to spend that time with her. I mean, she does keep dying, and he has to find another person like that matches her soul. Stop being a bad person. You two can die together and just be at peace. Just it as one like she doesn't need to keep reincarnating just quit being a douchebag no i get it. I, there's a lot here i don't know what the official meaning is but i like that that's actually kind of wild but cool and i don't know i like it though i really do i'm lost but i still love the song itself within temptation you guys just you always go above and beyond yeah i can never fully put into words you're just amazing you're so cold amazing I've said that about a lot of bands, but seriously, like, every band is unique in their own way, and you guys have an extra special. You're just awesome. You're epic, beautiful, hauntingly amazing, and insane. I can't even put into words what I just watched, but that. you guys in the comments, you'll let me know what you think. I hope you enjoyed today's video. Thank you so very much for watching. Please comment, like, and subscribe. And as always, remember, my name is Jeff. Pep Junkies Unite, and I'll see you guys tomorrow as always. Love, peace, and chicken grease. You guys have a fantastic day and a fantastic night.